Hi guys, what's going on? My name is Lucas. In today's video, I just wanted to show you uh, the new Xperia Home. Uh, this is a launcher that you can get on multiple Android devices. And for me, this launcher is very nice because even though I'm using the Xperia, um, Xperia Z2 from way back, I can still put on this Xperia launcher on my device. So, uh, yeah, currently I have installed the Xperia Home Launcher. Um, you have to go through App Mirror or APK Mirror. That's the way I chose to get that thing on here. Because, you know, if I just go into the Play Store and if you just search for um, um, Xperia Home, um, it will not pop up with any suggestions so you might think okay uh, what is going on where can I uh, where can I get this uh, launcher and you can see I'm filming this with the Exxon 7 so I don't know if I have to zoom uh, or if I have to tap to focus or whatever um, but the way I choose was uh, you go to your uh, Google and just search for um, Xperia uh, Xperia Home and just just search for it and it should pop up with Xperia Home APKs APK Mirror and boom you have your APK Mirror linked to the Xperia Home and here you have multiple versions you can get on there um, and what I feel is very nice is that even the latest, you know, Xperia Home version does work on the Xperia Z2. So if I just go on here, of course, we are getting an ad. Okay. So you go in there, boom. You can see it says uh, minimum um, minimum M Edward version is Android Lollipop. So you know, uh, onwards you can use the Xperia Home if you have Android 4 which is a very old version of Android nowadays and you should upgrade <laughs> but um, yeah you have to have at least Android 5 to run the Xperia Home launcher and yeah you just click on uh, download APK and it will take a few seconds and will then start to download this application and it will then you know come come and it then comes up with a little pop-up which says do you want to keep this ad or uh, do you want to keep this APK because it can harm your device and you just say okay because it's not harmful um, yeah and I can show you this here in my download section uh, there we go so it says um, it says uh, Sony Sony Ericsson uh, which is kind of nice like Sony Ericsson uh, you know Ericsson is not a part of Sony anymore so I don't I don't know why uh, this Ericsson is still in here but um, yeah com dot Sony Ericsson home and that's the main attraction that we are looking for you just tap on this and uh, it says open up with the packet installer and you of course could uh, you could scan this APK for any viruses and boom it says Xperia home Do you want to install this I uh, already have this home launcher so I don't need this yeah and uh, once you get it on there of course it, it, um, <clears throat> it varies from device to device uh, on my Z2 I have to go to home screen and then I can choose the Xperia home and uh, yeah if we go just go back you have this beautiful interface and I, I think um, Sony's launcher is one of the best uh, sorry guys one of, uh, Sony's launcher is like one of the best um, just wait a minute guys I have to take a phone call real quick guys <laughs> sorry so we are back here on the home screen and I will quickly show you all the options that are available here in this launcher so you can of course um, you can pinch pinch out I should say uh, to get to your um, options that you have here so we have widgets background designs um, trans transitions, um, the grid and the settings. First, we'll show you all the settings. You can add your Google feed to your home screen 
which is very useful. You have your suggest, you have your suggestions. You can enable uh, auto rotation. You know, all that good stuff is in here that you normally won't see on an older Sony device, um, which is, in my opinion, very very nice. Another great thing is the grid. So if you want to have a um, a like smaller grid, you can uh, absolutely do this here. Um, you know, this and all this, yeah, as in uh, is possible here. Uh, your transitions, you can go with whatever you want. Windmill is kind of my favorite, but I'm using Flow at the moment. Um, yeah, and of course you can choose from your designs um, and all that. The background, so no new wallpapers, unfortunately. Um, yeah, and that is pretty much it for uh, the whole settings you can customize here on the um, on the Xperia launcher. You can see I have a very large grid here, so you know uh, up to five icons um, fit on the home screen here. Uh, when it comes to this line, to the horizontal line, so uh, pretty pretty great. And also your Google Now integration here on the left side is pretty good. Um, I always wish um, that you know Sony devices would update their UI, but apparently that's possible through the APK mirror. Yeah, and that was a quick little showcase how you can get the Xperia Home Launcher uh, on your device. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, smack a like, subscribe, and all that good stuff, guys. It is so much appreciated. Um, yeah, and I will see you guys in the channel back soon with more videos to come. Bye for now.